Good evening, good evening, good evening. This is Pastor Carla, and we're doing Pearls with Pastor Carla. This week during Bible study, we've been studying the Synoptic Gospels and doing the Matthew account. And we came to a very familiar passage, Matthew chapter 9, verse 19, and it says, So Jesus and his disciples got up and went with him. Just then a woman who had suffered for 12 years with constant bleeding came up behind him. She touched the fringe of his robe, for she thought, if I can just touch his robe, I will be healed. She thought. She thought. That's the key thing that we were discussing in Bible study. That if she thought, if she, he could, she could touch, the, touch his robe, she would be healed. This is where God began to minister and really say that our thoughts are so important because she didn't speak. She didn't declare. She just had a thought. The Bible declares in Philippians chapter 4 verse 8 says, And dear brothers and sisters, one final thing. Fix your thoughts on what is true and honorable and right and pure and lovely and admirable. Think about these things that are excellent and worthy of praise. For if the woman with the issue of blood was able to be healed regarding a thought that she had, how much more power and authority do you think God wants us to have with our thoughts? She had a power of healing. The power of healing was in her thoughts. So let's try to recalibrate our minds as we're getting up for the day and preparing to the, do the assignment that the Lord has called us for that day. Let's fix our mind, as Philippians 4, 8 says, on what is true, honorable, right, and pure, lovely, and admirable. Think about the things that are excellent and worthy of praise. We do not want our minds cluttered. We do not want our minds filled with things that could go in the opposite direction, contrary to what God has for our life. So let's fixate our mind. For people of God, the woman with issue of blood was healed with just her thought. Amen. This is Pearls with Pastor Carla. Have a good day.